she feels helpless and alone, unsure of what to do or who to turn to. She tries to ignore the taunts and teasing, but it only gets worse as the day goes on. She feels like she's trapped in a nightmare, unable to escape the torment of her peers. As the day drags on, the girl becomes more and more isolated, withdrawing into herself and avoiding any interaction with her classmates. She feels like she doesn't belong, like she's an outsider looking in on a world that doesn't want her. Finally, the day ends and the girl is able to go home. But the damage has been done. She feels broken and defeated, unable to shake the feeling of being violated and humiliated. She wonders if things will ever get better, if she'll ever be able to find a place where she belongs. The next morning, the girl wakes up with a heavy heart, dreading the thought of going back to school. But something inside her stirs, a small spark of courage and determination. She decides that she won't let her classmates define her, that she won't let them tear her down. With a newfound sense of strength, the girl goes to school and faces her tormentors head on. She stands up for herself, refusing to be a victim any longer. Slowly but surely, her classmates begin to see her in a new light, as someone who won't be pushed around or taken advantage of. In the end, the girl emerges stronger and more resilient than ever before. She realizes that she doesn't need anyone else's approval or validation to be happy, that she can define her own worth and find her own place in the world. And with that realization, she sets out on a new journey, one filled with hope, possibility, and endless potential.